the shot. Save by Fisse. Boy, did Colorado spread that out. Look how Colorado is spread out. Dykos' shot blocked again by Adam Foote in front. Colorado's coming way out on the point. Yell, number 26, moved way out on Dykos. They're obviously concerned about the point shooters here as they want to get out and block it. There's Lindros. One-timer knocked away. I think off the paddle of Stefan Fisse. Held on to by Lindros momentarily. Falloon got it down low. Can't turn it in. Brenda Moore. Yell held on to his stick. Fans wanted a call. Good play by the rookie. He held on just long enough to deny the shot. Brenda Moore drops it back in. Dykehouse, his shot deflected wide. Stefan Fisse again got the stick on it. Brenda Moore back to the middle shot. And stop! the ability to do it. Beautiful pass from Rod Brindamore who beat his man in the corner. And you know what? The Avalanche had good coverage as far as being close to Forsberg that time. Point shot, save me! Oh, Kevin Haller was looking for one. He has an through center. Nobody can get through center right now. And <laughs> still can't. Here's the break the other way. Brought back in. Shot by Frank scores! Peter Forsberg and then collides with Hexball who came down heavy on Forsberg. Oh, did he ever. And Colorado Hextall, he's throwing away the lumber that's busted now. This Ron, game's tied at one, though. But Ron Hextall, he knew immediately he'd been scored upon, and it was his chance to exact some revenge on Peter Forsberg, so he gave Forsberg a pretty rough ride. But Forsberg, wide open in the middle of the ice, and Claude Lemieux found him perfectly. Forsberg's looking up at his own replay now. This kid plays a tough as well as a talented game. One. No question. If you want to turn up the heat physically on Peter Forsberg, you better have your seatbelt on because he will match you. There was the trip. It was not like Forsberg tried to jump into Hextall. And there's Ron Hextall going at it with Forsberg down under him. Hextall is very fortunate not to get a penalty on this. Peter Forsberg is 19. This is number 22. the center. Here's the chip ahead of two on O. Brenda Moore is winning the shot. And a save made by Fassette on Quinn. A two on O. Chalk that one down in this shot right over the net, but Eric Desjardins deflected it. Ron Hextall had dumped the rebound right out in front. Then there wasn't much of a shot. Win. Win looking it over. Cross ice, Lindros shot. Score! Man, does he have the Midas touch. Beats it between the bad power play goal. 2-1 Philadelphia. You could just see that going to happen with Quinn eyeballing Lindros and Lindros in a shooting position. And I love the signs that are out here, but Lindros, goal number 35, here's the setup, looking, 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 all right, the time is right, and Lindros unloads it, wow, what a wrist shot, another power play goal for the Flyers, and that wasn't screened at all, that just beat Fisse right through the legs, Brindamore was the closest guy to his screening, but we got a winner. Stephen Kennedy got a second. For Bobby Clark, a nice play by Wallana. Just a long enough stick to get that one. Peter Forsberg moving in. Forsberg, the shot. He scores! What a play! What a tremendous shot by Peter Forsberg, who looked as though he wasn't going to be able to turn that on the forehand. He did, and he roofed it. And it's 2-2. What a player. Forsberg now with both avalanche goals. Well, this is what I was talking about, why the Flyers wanted so badly to take a 3-1 lead in the power play. Good D at the avalanche end. Squeezed the man off. Then Craig Willan had moved it up ice. Watch this one-man show. Oh, what a move. Just to get a transition back to the forehand. Watch this. Back to the forehand. Perfect chip shot. That is a hard shot to execute. High to the short side. Ron Hextall committed. But some coverage breakdown. There it is again. See Ron Hextall just going down on his side. This is really unusual. Watch the two defensemen right here in the middle of your screen. Let Troy Murray come right between them. 
Actually, it was a forward and a defenseman. It was Eric Desjardins and Pat Falloon. That is uncharacteristic of Eric Desjardins. Maybe he thought that Falloon was going to take Troy Murray, but Murray made that one look. It. Drops it back for him to more. Quick little shot deflected. Oh, yes, he scores! Oh, the quick wrist to Lindros! His second of the night. We're tied at three! Oh, what an exhibition these teams are putting on. I'm telling you. The stars of the hockey clubs have come to play. Forsberg for the Avalanche, Lindros for the Flyers. Each have registered two goals. Boy, what a drop pass here, and then continue at the net. Rod Brindamore reads it. It's deflected, and there's Lindros for the rebound, and in she goes. Way out of tie, And there's jubilation from their captain, and the crowd all on their feet. Now, Foot was right with Lindros, but he couldn't stop from scoring. Lindros from Brindamore and Falloon at 12.54. Kaminsky again knocked it away. Here's Lemieux moving in. Lemieux looking. Lemieux the shot. Lemieux was able to keep going. Watch Lemieux smartly let go of his stick. He knew that he had to hold his stick lightly. Lemieux moving in. Lemieux looking. Lemieux the shot. Score! Oh, Lemieux with a second effort. And the MVP of the stand. Rebound centered for the player. Never got there. Lindros shot. Banged off. Sylvain Lefebvre. Quinn shot. Deflected in the skates. Stephon Fissé. For Colorado, but it's not done. Back up on the point, intercepted, empty net. Forsberg for the hat trick. Feathers it. He got it. His first hat trick. Peter Forsberg puts it home, and Colorado has got a five to three lead, and he sends them home in Philadelphia.